so a while ago the guys from netview sent me a, a bird feeder um, and i tested it out and it was it's it's a, a, a wi-fi bird feeder so that you can connect it to wi-fi it'll alert you when there are birds on the bird feeder and it'll take some images and video as they're on the feeder and it also identifies the birds which is really great and to be honest well that wasn't great with the identification in the first place it seems to have got better over time i have to say so they approached me again asked me if i'd test out this birdhouse so this birdhouse has actually got a camera here so that you can see when the birds are coming into the nest uh, it's actually got a detector on there so it will alert you again when the birds are approaching the nest and then it's also got a separate camera inside so if we open up the side here we've actually got a camera mounted inside here and this is actually the detector for when the birds are coming in so we detect them coming in it'll it'll video them as they're coming into the feeder and it'll also record them inside the feeder so if we get some little birds in the spring we can actually watch them growing up in the nest which is going to be absolutely great it's actually now what just by well, end of end of november so we're not going to get anything straight away but hopefully the birds will start checking this out and then in the spring potentially we'll have some birds in the actual nest box so that's what i'm looking forward to trying um, there was a little bit of assembly work just to assemble the camera onto the back of it um, not much else to be honest i've charged it up fully i'm going to mount it up on the fence and then hopefully we'll see what happens one thing they say is when you're mounting um, bird boxes like this don't have them south facing because they'll get too hot when the birds start to nest uh, and you're in danger of actually killing the young birds off so i've got a fence post down here which is pretty sheltered um, it's right in the corner so it's going to be out of the way um, and we're just going to see how that goes hopefully we're going to get a wi-fi connection to it we've tested it the wi-fi seems to work okay hopefully the wi-fi is good enough to get to that if not we'll just have to move it around the garden to a different position but yeah, I'm going to go and put this up and then hopefully we can see if we can get any birds in there. So that's going to be great. Let's go and see. So that's it that was pretty simple to actually do that um, we just there's the various ways you can you can actually mount this there are some um, some clips that you can put around a pole uh, there's a strap where you can strap it around a tree or well, there's a bracket which I've used on here I've just I've just mounted the bracket onto the fence post and then put the bird feeders just slotted it onto the bracket um, I've then mounted there's actually a solar panel that comes with it so the solar panels mounted above it I've just put that on the fence as well so that's going to charge it as well so hopefully it's going to sit out here it won't need much charging if we have to top it up we'll take it in the house just top it up but otherwise you can just sit out here and charge quite merrily when the sun's out like it is today um, so yeah so we just got to see what happens it'd be great to see if the birds start investigating it because uh, in the autumn time they'll probably start to look for places they might investigate it might just look at look and check it out a little bit and then hopefully in the spring they'll decide to nest in it so what we can see inside is there's a camera inside and if we look on the app we've connected the app on the phone to the box and that's connected wi-fi back to the house and if we look on the app we can actually see both inside the box and the front view into the entrance hole here so we can see both areas and they say once something enters into here through the entrance hole that will set off the notification that will notify notify me that there's something coming into the box and there we go um, and yeah you can see it's quite simple it shows you all the things and then it just does a little recording we can play that back 
and see what's been coming in. It takes an image. Um, yeah, and it's going to be great. Uh, I mean, this is something I've really wanted to do uh, for quite a long time, is actually put a, a camera into an Xbox. So thanks to the guys from Netview for sending me this, I'm actually able to do that now. So I'll put some uh, links in the description below to this. Um, as I say, it, it's just for me to try out really. If you like it, then up to you. Um, but yeah, we're not going to get any results straight away. We're not going to see the results till next year, so it's going to be a little while. So hopefully we can do a follow-up video and actually show you some of the results. But that's it for now. Feed box is up. We've just got to see what happens. So whatever you're doing, have a great day. Hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch up with you again soon. Bye for now.